Hello everyone, it is Gaming on Linux Guide with Gadget Guy. Today I want to show you how to install the Proton layer called Glorious Egg Roll. And it is made by a user called Glorious Egg Roll. And the reason to use it is that it has a lot of game fixes that currently aren't a part of the current version of Proton. And can really help fix some of those really high priority games such as Baldur's Gate 3 and the reason I'm making this video is because I want to make people aware of it but also because I don't feel like I went thoroughly enough in depth in my Baldur's Gate 3 how to run video and I want to make sure that people knew how to install it because it does make Baldur's Gate run pretty well. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to a web browser I like to use DuckDuckGo. And then you're probably going to search Glorious Egg Roll Proton. And the first thing you get is a GitHub link made by the wonderful Glorious Egg Roll. And then you click that link. Then you want to go over here to the side and click the releases button because we want the releases. And then we want this uh, Proton 5.9 GE-8-ST.tar.gz. It's called a tarball often. And it is sort of like a zip file, but a lot of Linux stuff will use it. Now, I've already got it on my desktop because I wanted to show off Baldur's Gate. Uh, but I will show how to install it better this time. So we just wait for it to download. Thankfully, I have some decent-ish download speeds, especially for my area. And then what you want to do is I download it to my desktop. So I'm going to open it. And then once it's done loading, I'll move it over here to show you. So here's the tarball opened. And you're going to want to go to, of course, you can't see this unless you go to View, Show Hidden Files. And then you can go to the .steam folder. So you want to go to .steam, then Steam again. And if this folder is not already in here, you've got to make a, you've got to right-click Create Folder, and it's got to be Compatibility Tools .d. That dot D is really important. Otherwise, it won't work properly. And then what you just do is you drag and drop it in that folder. Again, I already have it in there, but I'll replace it all. And sometimes this can take a little bit because there's a whole lot of little files in there, um, which are a lot harder to move than big files just because it's having to start and stop and start and stop and start and stop transferring the files. Now at the time of this recording, there is currently a new version of Proton, which makes a couple games run pretty well. And I'm going to show off a couple of them at some point in the future. But for right now, Glorious Egg Roll helps to make some really popular games run. And I'm not going to extract all this because, as I said, I already have it installed. Uh, it was more for demonstration purposes. And then I close that. And then you're going to have to restart Steam. Because if you don't, it doesn't show up as a compatibility layer. And then we restart it. And as you can see, it is connecting to my account again. And it's loading all those files that Steam loves to load. But once we go into library, we can now right-click a game once it's done loading. There we go. And we can go to properties. And then, of course, we can check, check force use of a specific Steam Play compatibility tool. 
5.9 GE as we said earlier and then you click close and you start your favorite game that is has some fixes such as Baldur's Gate 3. I hope this was helpful and I hope you will please subscribe if you found this helpful because it really does help the channel grow and get it out to more people who use Linux. So subscribe and other than that, have a great day.